Make your own dish soap following this very easy recipe. You only need three ingredients that you can find in any store. The first one is coconut oil. We use this specific type of oil for its cleansing properties in soap. The next ingredient is sodium hydroxide or lye that you can usually find in the cleaning section of your store because it's also used to clean drains. The last ingredient is the mineralized or distilled water. This type of water is used in soap making as it doesn't contain any metal particles that can react bad to the lye. For this project I'm going to be using some ceramic bowls, meaning that I will pour the soap directly into it. Don't use any type of metal containers for this purpose. Because we are dealing with lye, we need some safety precautions like protective eyewear and gloves. You don't want to get in any contact with lye, therefore also wear long sleeves and closed-toed shoes. Now let's get started with the actual soap making. Using a heavy plastic container or a stainless steel pitcher, you now want to weigh out your water. Add the lye slowly to the water, as called for in the recipe. Be very careful and weigh out the lye separately if you feel more comfortable. Now give the mixture a good stir until it becomes completely clear. Be careful not to inhale the fumes and put it aside where it cannot be knocked over. Now weigh out the coconut oil using a scale. It's very important to use a scale and not measure out by volume as the measurements in soap making need to be very precise. It's time to melt down the coconut oil. You can use a double boiler or a microwave to do so. Once the coconut oil is fully melted, I transfer it to a plastic container as glass is not suitable for lye. Then I add the lye solution to the oil and use a stick blender to combine the two. You will see the mixture become uniform and that tells you that you are ready to pour your fresh soap. You can pour the dish soap into a ceramic bowl or into a soap mold depending on your preference or what you have at hand. I like to pour it in a bowl for ease of use in dishwashing. The next day the soap is ready to use. Adding a brush and wrapping it would make a great gift idea. I hope you find this video helpful and if you are interested in other soap making related videos, feel free to check out the playlist here on the screen. Have a wonderful day and see you in the next video. Bye bye!